You mean as opposed to Din removing his helmet? Right. I think there's big differences in the backstory for them removing their helmets and in what they stand to gain by removing their helmets. A lot of people were so mad. They saw it as, oh, well, you let Bo take off her helmet, but right. you wouldn't let Mando take off his helmet. First of all, Mando was the one who decided that he wanted to go to the mines of Mandalore. I never told him to do that. But also, I think that the armorer is somebody whose thinking can evolve. And I think that she has come to see that we've been divided for too long. All Mandalorians need to work together. And she's seen that Bo has walked both worlds. And Bo has been willing to keep her helmet on while she's been in this particular covert. And so she sees her as someone who can perhaps bring the two of them together. Whether or not she can remains to be seen because we don't know if she'll be accepted by those helmetless Mandalorians anymore. Bo is a natural leader. Bo wants to lead. We don't really know that Mando wants to leave.